Hello everybody and welcome back for a new video. This time it's going to be about the 200 stacker. And we are going to try to do exactly as we are used to. Uh, first we're going to get into the spawn room first. And you see I, I made, made it a little bit better here. Kind of to, to try to help you a little bit more. Um, but our goal is definitely to to get the spawners first. Also those was I with a water it and then we're gonna backstack up some chests and then we're first gonna scatter up up to this room where this is absolutely no meaning why I did this. Oh yeah But uh first we're gonna get up to this room and I don't know just tr try to teach you how to reverse scatter and then we're gonna get down here and this is actually quite important because we're gonna hybrid down and get this flower pot right here. That's our goal. So that's what we're gonna do. But first of all, let's just see if this even stacks. So before you continue or for you, before you start, you make sure that the scatter is on. You make sure that the hammer down and slap bus is on. And here is one mistake already. That is my mistake. This is not a new schematic. So this is how you get a new schematic. But you're going to say, OK, so when you are this close to a base, you don't really need more hammer down than one tick. So that should be just fine. One tick all the way around. And then Whenever you have wet sand and sand in, you should be able to fire and it should take uh, get rid of that slab down there and stack up and everything will be perfect. So let's just see if that is the case. That was definitely not the case. Uh, stack 90 down. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. So now we need to figure out what's going on here. So let's add back those that I accidentally have placed there. I don't know why. On your schematic, again, they, they, it, this is all full text. I don't know why I did that on my, not on mine. Maybe because I checked first. Hmm. Oh well. Sometimes I like, sometimes I like to check the cam before we start up, just to make sure that they work. Um, Right here, as you see, it worked just fine. It was just me fucking up. Had some ticks on the cannon from the other time when I tried to to do something. But uh, right here, you see, it works fine. So the hybrid shot is fine, and it slap bust is fine. Duh, trust me on that. So now we have these spawners right here. Uh, you can aim. You can even aim the cannon right at the spawner, or you can do it up here. Even that doesn't matter. What the goal is is to make the TNT fall down. And you do that by, let me just quickly, you're going to add a dispenser right there. Put some TNT in it. Now let's redstone it up. Break this block and that block. And then place a block right here. Whoop, there you go. Break that block and put a repeater in there. Then have some redstone going like that. And then break this one right there, so it goes into all of this line. And make sure you don't have a t uh, sorry redstone right here, because then it ignites the scatter, and we can't really have that. But uh, that is just about it for this. And we're gonna, I'm gonna show you. Well, you're gonna probably gonna, it's probably gonna fall down like this and get the hopper and break the cobblestone if we do this. Uh, but we don't want that, so let's just go like this there you go that's gonna get rid of mm, two or three let's just hope it's three but before you do that let's get rid of the hammer and the slap bust that way it's not gonna fuck up and let's try again so what you should do now is just explode these three spawners here and there you go, it works just fine. And now we are coming to this right here. Um, there is a safe way and there is a fast way of doing it. Um, if this, these spawners here were a lot longer down, like let's say all the way down here, you would have to, you would have to properly, you're gonna need this backbone right here, so you can't destroy the top ones first. That means that you have to count the blocks, so that means one, two, three, four, four, five, six, seven blocks. And then whenever you go here, and this is the safe way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 
There you go. And then you're going to leave that off. You're going to keep the one shot, uh, not spawner TNT on. You're going to keep the wet sand in as well. And this should be it. Let me think. Yep, that should be it. And now when you do that, let's just hope it works. Nope, did not work indeed. That was because we need this online. Break the slap boss, we don't want that. Uh, let's try again. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Because you don't want to overstack. Because if you accidentally overstack, you're gonna get rid of your. Um, your 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 only hope is to get the sand stack down. That is by hybriding here, and you won't really have the backboard you need. But if you do it like this, like that, and now it's right here. So now I'm pretty sure we should hybrid. So let's hybrid. Uh, let's just hope that this TNT goes through correct. So let's hybrid. There you go, and that was one TNT, remember that. that It does look like it's a lot of TNT, but the hammer down is not hybriding. The, the TNT right down here is, even though it looks like it's not. But as you see, they are gone, definitely gone, and we can now go further. And now we want to get up to this one right here. These are chests. I just made it planks because uh, my sand breaks on chests at the moment. Uh, but right now, let's just try to put everything back to normal because we are going to need to do other stuff now. So let's just see here. Every, every time you do something, and you have to do something else, always put the uh, cannon back to normal so you don't accidentally forget something. Uh, here it is, that's the, how it was before, that's how you get your schematic as well. And now we need to reverse up. So if you want to reverse up, we are going to need to change something in here. First of all, you're going to sit right here, look forward, look forward, place a block, it can be any block. Then you need to use a trap door to place right there. It should be so there can be a block right here. After that, you destroy the guider. Oh, yep, all the guider. And then, whenever you shoot now, it should have a reverse scatter effect. Uh, so let's just try that. That will give a, get a, give us access to the top room. So let's just see it goes. There you go. That might be a little bit too much, but alright. <laughs> we got into that room. And now you can get whatever you want in here. But let's get that flower or mushroom down there now. Um, now that you have destroyed your backboard, what the fuck? Uh, no mind. Um, now you need to scare. Uh, sorry, you need to go down, and uh, we want to make it a hybrid shot. So why don't we just put the cannon back to normal? Like one, two, three, four. There you go. And then, when you go in here, you remove the comparator, use a repeater on full, full text right there. Place one sand and one, uh, and one cobweb. Uh, there's multiple ways to do this. Uh, normally, I would take the scatter off and keep the hammer on, of course. And then when we fire, it should have a hybrid effect down. <clears throat> As you see, it went one down, so let's just continue. Oh, by the way, you should d disable the wet sand, just because that is going to make it more efficient. So let's just do that right there. Let's go again. Oh, something is getting loud now. Something dying by him. Uh, but we fight again. Let's see if we can get a hybrid shot more. And now we're at a down at our flower. And you can take your beautiful tree back. And you can get your beautiful flower. And that is that is it. I don't think there's anything else about this. Um, this hybrid method, hybrid down, goes down to bedrock. 
So that means that if you wanna uh, get down to bedrock, well, you can just let, let, let me get down here. Thank you. So if you want to go all the way down to bedrock, you can do that simply by quickly just show you here. Gosh dang it, that's a lot. Uh, that's 40. I should not. Oh, yeah, there you go. And now that you're down here, you can, let's say, let's make a fake chest here. There you go, it has something on top of it, and then it has water, and you want to get that chest. You can easily do that again, simply by adding a cobweb, sand. Right there, oops. There you oh gosh, there you go. And now whenever we shoot, it should get rid of most anything all the way down, and it should get a hybrid shot down here. And there you go. And again, this is this is quite useful uh, if you do this with spawners. Uh, so you want to reverse down to get spawners. You should only use one TNT in the slab bust. So I'll I'll just remove some of these dispensers until there is just one dispenser, and that will make it a a perfect hybrid shot with one TNT, and that will probably give you the spawner as well. But I think there's nothing else to this video. Um, let me see. I went over everything, and I'm, I'm pretty sure that's it. So if you enjoyed my my little video here, and if you have any questions about it, you feel free to comment down below. And if you doing it another another way that you want me to to look at, if you think that's better than mine, go ahead and leave a, a comment also. Uh, any issues with the cannon? Comment down below as well. Yeah, I already said that. Like my videos. Uh, and let me know what you think. Should I keep doing this basic tutorials on the cannons? I know that I have two of these now, but these are more like going so I kind of show people what's going on and how to do stuff. So I kind of like doing these so you guys know what to do. Um, but I think that I think that's just about it. Oh, did you see that? It actually blew it up even though it was water covered. That's that's cool, but I think that is just about it. Uh, remember to subscribe to my channel. Uh, my name is Dexter, and I'm out.